What's up guys, it's DJ here in the UGC and look, today is crazy. Tom caught Jerry, the Washington Commanders won their football game and Plankton? Plankton got his hands on the Krabby Patty formula. It's like nah, none of that happened, but GTA 6 did leak, so let's talk about it. I'm pretty sure you all know by now, but today was a horrible day for Rockstar Games. There's a user by the name of Teapot Uber Hacker who leaked over 90 videos of Grand Theft Auto 6 and they claim to have much more. Now I'm not going to put the footage here for obvious reasons. Uh, Rockstar and Take 2 are two trees that I don't want to be barking up. They're already issuing out DMCA's and, and that's not something I want to deal with. But if you want to see the footage, it's not too hard to find. Now there was some skepticism at first because people didn't think this was really from GTA 6. But Bloomberg did an article today, they did confirm that it is from GTA 6 and this is a serious issue. So what we know about it so far is that it's going to take place in Vice City. Uh, this is present day Vice City and there's going to be a female and Latin protagonist. It looks like they were going for more of a Bonnie and Clyde type of thing. Now I don't want to get too deep into trying to figure out what the story or plot is or whatever, but I do want to talk about how stupid this hacker is because it's one thing to just leak videos of an unfinished project, but it's a whole nother ball game when you say you have the source code and you're holding that for ransom. And this is exactly what this guy is doing. So the hacker wrote a letter today to Rockstar and Take Two. He gave his contact information and he said, hey, contact me, I have more, but I'm looking to negotiate a deal. I don't know what that sounds like to you, but that sounds like extortion to me. Now, either this guy is supremely confident in his ability to stay anonymous, or he's just a fucking idiot. Rockstar is known for sending suits after modders, and they have billions. I mean, I don't know what this guy is thinking. Another reason the leak is bad is because it could possibly delay GTA 6. Now obviously we don't want that, it's been 10 years since the last GTA release. So yeah, Rockstar and Take 2, yeah 10 years, that's, that's a whole nother video I could do. But anyway, I just wanted to let y'all know how I felt about the situation. Let me know what you think about it in the comments. As always, I appreciate you stopping by and watching the video, and I'll catch you next time. Peace.